I'd seen them before and I kind of knew their tendencies a little bit and I knew as long as I kept the ball down I, I had fielders behind me and they'd be able to uh, they'd be able to make plays for me I guess. Okay and as you got really your whole team standing behind you so I'll give people the warning there. Uh, the bats gave you just enough uh, on, on the offensive side I mean talk about that a little bit. Uh, Troy, I think Troy Aldridge, he came up real big, clutch spot. I think most of our runs we scored with two outs. And we've done that a lot this season, and it, it feels really good when we put up two extra, two extra runs. We got the win, and that's that's the big key part of it. Uh, you know, Austin pitched him uh, earlier this season, did a great job of it. We just were not able to get the, the bats going for him like we were tonight. Uh, I just think that uh, we, we we finally had it in us to where we wanted to get you know some support for him. We had some some great hits, some guys that haven't hit the ball well here lately. I uh, got some great hits out of him, and, and Austin just did what he needed to to shut him down on the mound. Just enough hitting. You got a little bit early. That insurance run on in the sixth, uh, I'm sure, made everything at least a little more comfortable for you going in. Uh, I mean, talk about the bats. Just enough from a few guys. You know, with a one-run lead like that as a coach, you know, you're, you're sweating bullets because you just know that one pitch could change a big deal, or, or a leadoff walk, or something could change a big, uh, big part of the game with a bunt or something like that. So it's always nice to get that extra one, so that you do have a guy get on. You're not having to worry about him. You can go after the batters. Uh, and you, you're right. We did. We hit the ball hard, uh, and you know. We hit the ball hard a number of times, and they just made some great plays. Hats off to their defense because they made a couple of great what we call sports center plays, and uh, they kept uh, themselves in the game, and, and we just did it at the end. We were able to shut down on the mound. Get a few days to kind of recuperate going. you got a tough St. Albert team, same location here on Tuesday night. Uh, I would assume I think everybody's going to think you're probably going to throw Woods against them. I mean, what's it going to take for you guys to go in there and have a chance? You know, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll practice on Monday. We're back up here on Tuesday versus St. Alberts. Uh, they're a very good squad. Uh, we played them earlier this year, and, and, and they can really hit the ball hard. Uh, you know, uh, the pitching idea there, uh, you know, you can assume what you want to. Uh, what we're going to go with, we have, and uh, uh, see where we're lines up for defensively. Uh, we're going to have to hit the ball uh, better than we did even tonight. Uh, and, we, and we've had some great games. We've hit the ball hard. Uh, and, and even tonight, we hit the ball hard, just didn't hit the ground. So uh, against a, a great St. Alberts team like they are, and they've been very competitive here in the last few years, uh, uh, you know, we're going to have to come out and make sure offensively that we're doing the job and, and not just make sure we're only scoring two or three runs that we need there uh, you know and offensively doing what we need to and defensively making sure we're making some plays no errors and uh, you know we've talked about it all year airless baseball or no ease we call them and uh, um, you know we had a couple errors tonight we were able to come through it and uh, again Austin on the mound just had a great night and, and was able to get it done. I want to ask you just overall I mean just kind of what, what's been I mean you guys struggled quite a bit early in the season even really even into the middle portion but uh, you guys put together a pretty good run got some pretty good Hawkeye 10 wins I mean what's kind of changed this season where you guys are are right there playing some pretty good ball right now. You know, we uh, we had some kids uh, that uh, you know got in trouble. There's a couple kids suspended. Uh, uh, we had a couple kids that were ineligible early on in the season. Uh, we've had some kids get hurt. Um, but you know, when, when we've won the games we've needed to, we we just played some very good baseball. And you know, and this 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 team I have here is is very capable of playing very good baseball. And uh, we beat some teams this year that you know we haven't beaten in, in four or five or six years. So uh, you know, we've been kind of the underdogs for most games that we've been in this year. And, and I think that that kind of gives the guys a little drive to where hey, you know, we're, we're going to come out here and do that what we can to, to get the job done. And I'm sure we're going to be the underdog for, you know, on Tuesday game with St. Albert's being ranked. But we're going to come out here and give them the best shot we can and, and know that if we, even if we get beat, we left it everything on the field that we have. But, um, you know, I, we're going to come up here with some confidence and, and get the job done.